Okay, so let me give you a bit of a background. I fell out of a tree, four meter tree, at early in the morning. My lights on. It's really it before sunset. And um, I fell four meters onto my legs and I broke both my legs. I severed all of my tendons and I severed all of my ligaments in my right leg and I severed a few t tendons in my left leg. I never broke any bones and I dislocated my thumb. I'm lucky I didn't fall on my head. I woke up really early this morning and I've had a look at my forecast, my unmanned aerial forecast and the wind's like 11 meters per second at 100 meters high which is like cut off and um, I've only got until about 8 o'clock and then the wind's gonna pick up. I've googled sunrise 6.44 and um, it's like quarter past 5 a.m. now so I've got some time to get my stuff together um, my fly more kit's fully charged and I'm going to get my stuff together with my crutches and I'm going to hobble downstairs. Carla will kill me if she knows I'm going to do this. I've got my coffee in my flask and my idea is I'm going to take her car keys if I can find them and I'm going to pull the wheelchair out the back of her car while on crutches and I'm going to set myself up and the golden hour apparently is at like 6, 6.50 to 7.30, something like that. And so I'm going to take you guys on a very naughty, naughty cruise. I haven't flown at night much, but this is like dawn, so it's getting lighter. And um, I think it's going to be a load of fun. I can't wait to do it. And I'm going to put my brakes on. I'm going to be sitting and flying from a wheelchair. And um, let's see what happens. Wish me the best of luck, buddy. Okay, guys, so I'm keeping it kind of quiet. It's like it was five in the morning and I'm on a wheelchair because I broke both my legs and my arm and I've shimmied down three flights of stairs from the top of that building and I'm in the parking lot that's my girlfriend's car so I'm gonna set myself up over here behind the car I was gonna set myself up over there some space but cars come around the corner there because she has a gate so I'm gonna set myself up over there behind there I'm gonna roll forward and put my home point perhaps like about I don't know like about over there so let's see how this goes wish me like golden hour in about half an hour you can see it's starting to get light
a friend called me, asking me, where the hell are you? She noticed I wasn't sleeping next to her. And obviously I'm in a wheelchair. So she wanted to know what the hell was I thinking. So I told her I'm flying the drone. <laughs> there it is. I was flying it in manual focus for a while and I couldn't understand what was going on. And um, I wanted to take it off D, D like, D kinny, and because that's sometimes when you get like a little bit of um, like haze around the side to make it more realistic. Um, and eventually I realized I, I even actually brought the drone back, you might see it in the footage, and gave the screen like a little bit of a wipe. <laughs> but uh, at the end of the day, uh, I just had it on manual focus, so it's the small things like this that we forget. But yeah, had some fun, lost a little bit of signal, there's a lot of, uh, there's a lot of mansions, yeah, with a lot of uh, radio interference. Even our president actually lives up here. So um, yeah, first battery gone, I'm gonna reload it, and let's take it for another spin.